Welcome back, adventurers, to episode 10 of our Drill Dozer Let's Play. In the previous episode, we came back to find out that Jill was in jail, but the Drill Dozer came to life, came alive to go and save her. As after we saved Jill and started to make our escape from the prison, we find Detective Carrie, who surprisingly is helping us now. She noticed that the police and the Skulkers were working together, and while she doesn't condone what we're doing, she's fine with. She's not fine with what the police are doing even more. After that, she opened a gate for us, and we had to fight a guard tower that came to life due to the green diamond. We destroyed it, e even though it took a, a while, and we got the green diamond, our fourth out of five di diamonds. And now, back to adventure! I bet you got you think you got away, but not so fast. Oh wait, that wasn't his voice. Uh, it's time you meet my drill missile. It's just a fun little toy I've been working on. <laughs> you pathetic red dozers have no idea what you're up against. I'm going to make sure you never have a home to go back to. <laughs> Oh, that doesn't sound good. Didn't even take us to the map select. Oh, no. Oh, that's flying right for us. No, not a home. Ah. Oh. Wait. But it didn't explode. Um. That's kind of worrying. That drill missile landed on my kill! And it's. <clears throat> and it's drilling straight through our base. It's gonna be headed for our secret command center. And you know who's there. Drill's dad! Big boss Doug! Oh, I thought they kept him on the tent. My bad. You gotta do some. We have to do something to stop that thing before it gets here! Easy. I'll just go up and drill in the opposite direction. Oh, we start above. Listen up. It looks like the missile exhaust vent is still open. Head through that vent to sneak inside the missile. You're the only one who could stop that thing. We're counting on you. Alright. You couldn't see, but I, like, clamped my fist into my hand. It sounded like I clapped, but I clamped my fist into my hand. Let's do this. The best way to stop that drill from spinning is to demolish the engine room. The good news is, it's right below you. Uh... What's the bad news? Ooh, money! Yes, money. Oh, it keeps moving. Okay. We're gonna have to hurry on through this. Ah, uh, this isn't good. It looks like the missile is designed to explode if you destroy the engine. Yeah, not good. You're gonna have to go down deeper into the missile. You need to destroy the shaft that's spinning the drill bit. It's our last hope. Okay. So let's just keep drilling through this stuff. And down we go. And there are more of these guys, the basic enemies. I presume that Electric 4 w will electrocute us if we... Apparently not. What's that blue electricity do? Probably just moves slow. And the pink one moves fast. Huh, kinda reminds me of me and my friend. And I'm, I'm keep. I'm sorry about the late vocal reaction, future me. You're probably gonna think there's an audio desync. Just to prove you, to you there's not. Drill. Now when I started drilling, when I hit the thing, drill, drill. There we go. You happy, future me? The audience is probably confused because the audio is either desynced right now because I tried to sync it or sync. Oh, by the way, we got the second gear. Why do they keep these gears inside of a missile that's going to destroy our base? That seems kind of counterintuitive to their plan. Why am I still talking like this? In a world, in a world where drills are the main thing that drives this economy. And I do goofy voices and try to make a living. But I don't have a bank account yet. Dun dun dun. And underneath, nope, 
and underneath. There we go. And down here. Where'd Pinky go? Oh, there's Pinky. I'm getting hit by everything, but I have enough health to tank it all, so, you know. I forgot to check to see if I could buy anything in the la at the beginning of this episode. Here's hoping that we could... Oh, the penguins probably have a set path, and the blues probably follow um, whatever path is available. Is that it? Nope, they, they both do whatever they want, or the, whatever path is available. And come on through, and there we go. Ow. Well, good thing, good news, we're still at most of our health. We only lost one full bar. Bad news, that's one full bar. What is, ow, so, I, I walked into that. Okay, so these panels flip after a rotation, I'd assume? Yeah. After a full back and forth, it flips. Okay, now would not be a good time to fall. And now to our third gear and the epic music. This might actually be a short episode if, if the drill isn't that difficult. I say that, I'm probably going to fall and lose all my progress here. And parkour? Why did I ca call that parkour? Oh, you don't really get knocked that far anyways. Oops. I don't know why I said oops. Oh, and monies? No, health. Good, I needed it. Can I make it over there? Here's hoping. Yes, I can. Why did I fall off then? S screw it. Oh my god, I walked. There goes all the health that I just got. And even more. No, don't. Ooh! Sorry about the silence there. Uh, more health, please. You could probably hear my computer chugging along in the back right now. It's officially started to reach its limit. Oh, this is gonna be a short episode. This is gonna be easy. Falls many times. I've stopped caring. Huh. Oh, for a second I thought the background was turning, like, blood red, as in, you're about to lose. Huh, so now we're going into a different section of the drill with this thing. Oh, I bet we're going to be pa cha pace chased by a Pac-Man here. I bet uh, my shoulder fountain on it. We don't play jazz down by the shoulder fountain. No one knows what... John Mulaney. I'm not even going to steal his jokes anymore. I mean, not anymore. I haven't really been stealing his jokes. I usually credit people when I use their jokes. I'm like, uh, that joke's from a reference to this. I'm not even- but I'm gonna try and stop doing that. I'm gonna start coming up with my own original jokes for now. Moses Let's Play has been- I'm gonna start Let's Playing a good way. And through here- oh, well, I just charged directly into that. And they're probably gonna be pink. I mean, I probably could've- oh, I can't- ow, I can't. Well, that was simple. And health. Okay. Oh. Fall off! The missile is already drew 150 feet down! Hurry up and get to the tip of the missile and destroy that shaft! Okay. Now we have a time limit. Three minutes. Three minutes until our base is screwed! Okay. Here's hoping there's a bomb right here so it'll blow up everything else so I can collect them on my No. Is it in the same spot here? Oh, so I just drew through the entire bottom. Well, that's kind of annoying. Mild annoyance. I assume I need to use the bombs to get through this part. Oh, this is annoying. I'm glad they gave us three. Oh my god, me. Stop being stupid. There we go. And the bomb blows up, and it blows up that as well. Bomb, be somewhere in here, please. Oh, well, I just sat there in that. I just totally spaced out and just sat there for that. This time it's gonna be in the top, right? Because the rules of threes should say- yeah. There we go. 
Now what? Oh, makes sense. It's like you cannot continue through this level if you don't have the uh, upgraded drill. Oh, you you didn't buy it? Well, uh, too bad. S sucks to be you. And go. And money. There we go. Oh, this is gonna be a tricky one, isn't it? Yeah! Uh, is there money? No money. Okay, wasted some time. Oh, a minute and 30 left. That's... Oh, you probably need to... Do this. And this is how you don't get hurt. Just hurry up and blow them all up. There we go. A minute and... That much left. And... There we go. Explode. Explode the whole thing. Okay. I walked into that. I admit it. I take full responsibility. I will go to jail now. Jail's pretty nice. Looks exactly like my home. That or my home is jail. Is that a metaphor for life? Is that a metaphor for something? Huh. Probably. Probably has some sort of hidden meaning or something. You know. Oh. I thought that was the last one, because there didn't need to be one under there, but apparently there was. We have 40 seconds left. Christ. Okay, and down here. Oh, no. No. Health, please. We have 30 seconds left. Just drill through the center. I probably should have drilled through the right, but, you know, forget it. Oh, the center was the one without anything. Come on. And shift up. And shift up. Uh, sorry about the lack of commentary focusing. No, I didn't do it. No. Don't tell me I have to go through. Oh, okay, only this section. Uh, yeah, 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 we know. Time limit. But now we know uh, how to do this part. part. And drill the other way. Pink and blue. Pink, blue. Come on, we got this. Come on, adventurers. What if this ends up having the last diamond we need? What if this is actually the finale? That'd be kind of crazy. I mean, it would be a perfect bookend. This is this is level ten, and this would be episode ten. For a second there, I wasn't sure she was gonna make it. All you have to do now is spin the shaft backward. That should back the missile up out of the hole. And here we go. Back up and out. And now we've become the drill. You did it, boss! The drill mission is backing out to the surface! Oh, uh, darn it. Reversing the engines has set off the missile's self-destruction sequence. You gotta get out of there, boss! Wait, I have an idea. Don't panic yet. You need to go back to the engine room, the one you used to enter the miss missile. There should be a switch there. Flip it. That should get the engine to run in reverse. Jill, no, wait. Boss, I know you can do it. Now hurry. Oh, the stakes are now high. Oh, this is like... Final... Uh, boss material here. Come on. Come on. Get through the blast doors. Oh, this is intense! No! I stopped drilling. Yep, and there goes the explosion. Okay, now we need to... I didn't even pay attention to what it was doing to the robots. It probably was making mincemeat out of them. Yep. Oh, uh, this is so tense. This is intense. Cause we're out camping! <laughs> we're not out camping. Whoever told you that is a big fat liar. They're trying to slander me. Lies. Lies and slander. 
help on being slandered. And through there, blast doors. Come on. Keep on swimming. Keep on drilling. Keep on drilling, drilling, drilling. What do we do? We do not die. Go through the door. Which is really rusty and old. Like, it belongs in the warehouse, but we're actually... Ooh, this looks like a boss room. And the explosion stopped there. Good. Who knew wooden boards would make stuff so tough? The switch in that room controls the missile's engines. Flip that lever, and you should be home free. Okay. Way to go, boss! It's too dangerous to hang around here too long. You better get out of there, quick! Um, why did that blue thing not move? I've got some bad news. The explosion caused the engine to overload. But you're... You're as good as burnt toast unless you act fast. There should be a coolant tower to your left and to your right. You're going to have to keep the coolant levels in perfect balance. The coolant level on the left tower is dropping. Move the control chip in the tower to the right to the one on the left. Okay. Oh, so this is just a balance game. Oh, oh, I, I pressed the wrong button. I, I pressed... Come on. Okay. No! I... <sighs> that was a very whiny no. I thought this episode was going to be a lot shorter than it was. Turns out I was wrong. Yeah, yeah. I get it. There we go. We cannot let it over overheat. Got it. Uh, come on, we know all this. Come on! Move it to the left. And move it to the right. Does that just slowly fill up? Come on to the to the left. I believe it fills up every time we do this. Oh! So sometimes it tries to goof us up. Oh, you have to take it out and put it back in whenever that happens. Okay. And it's almost perfectly balanced. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. I did it, I did it. Okay, good. Stand in the middle until it's... Okay, that's a good point. Come on. This is tense. Let's let it get super far, so that way... Okay, and now we just need to move it over to the right one last time, unless it goes black again. PERFECT BALANCE! Oh, that was kind of stressful. Ooh, good job. I knew we could count on you. Well, the Stokers sure have kept us busy. Let's give them a little fireworks just to show them our thanks. Ooh. That sounds like someone who's angry. I would be too if our base was trashed. And then Jill's gonna jump out at the last second, isn't she? Huh? I like how she fell on her back too. Just a oh no. Oh. Huh. Boom. Well, that's that. The skulkers are gone. Gonzo. I don't think that was the end. I don't think that was the end at all. That seems like a level. I had the secret weapon custom built for my evil purposes. All for the day when I would conquer the world. Who would have thought I'd end up using it so soon? What a pleasant surprise. Who would have thought I would end up using it so soon? Nah, not a good voice for him. Actually, yeah, I'll do that voice from now on. Krug's voice has now changed twice. I didn't think even Krug would do something this evil. We can't just let him get away with it.
Is that it? Well, that appears to be it. Well, adventurers, after a long journey, a drill was shot at our base, and we had to dig into it and put it in reverse and then cool down an engine in order to disarm it and send it back at his base. Unlucky for us, he had a backup plan, a failsafe option. Appears next episode we'll be tackling this failsafe option. If you liked the video, please leave a like, uh, or comment or share with your friends. It helps my channel grow. And if you really want to see more and be notified whenever a new video comes out, why don't you like uh, drill into that subscribe button over there? See what I did? Look what I drilled over? Huh. It's a funny. And um, yeah, I suppose that's it for now. See you guys in the next episode.